in this experiment we will learn how we can make water glow in the dark. Let's do an experiment in glowing water. Take three different color highlighter. Take out the refill. Take three bottles. Put them in the bottles. You can see the water takes up the color of the highlighter. The water has taken the color of the highlighter. Now see the bottles in the dark room. That's because the water has taken the color of the highlighter. We will learn how the water travels through paper towel. Let's learn an experiment. Take three glasses one by one. Add blue color to one glass. Add red color to another glass. Both the color water gets mixed. Now make paper towel bridge. The colored water transfers into the empty glass. This is because the air pockets of the paper towel soak the water. Let's do an experiment with cold water and hot water. Now carefully place it on cold water jar. Add blue food color in the cold water jars. Place it carefully on hot water jar. Add red food color in the hot water jars. Place the plastic sheet on a cold water jar. Place it carefully on hot water. Now place the bottles carefully. Remove the plastic sheets one by one. This is because the hot water is less dense than the cold water. Let's see how electricity can be generated from salt water. Take a bulb. Take a battery case. Take a battery. Take some clear water. Add some salt. Connect the battery with... Connect the battery to the bulb with the wire. Join the bulb and the salt water with wire. Hey, you can see the bulb ignited. This is because chemical energy stored in salt water gets converted into electrical energy with the help of battery.
in this experiment we will learn to change the color of the flower. Take two test tubes. Add yellow food color to one test tube. Add red food color to another test tube. Place two white flowers in each test tube. You can see the flower changes the color. This is because the stem absorbs the colored water and travels to the petals. Let's see how light transfers through water. Take an empty plastic bottle. Make a hole with a driller. Pour some water in the bottle. Now you can see water coming out from the hole. You can see the light traveling in the water. This is because the molecules of water absorb light. In this experiment, we will learn how we can stop falling of water from the holes of a bottle. Let's do an interesting experiment. Make the holes on the same level. Now open the bottle. You can see the water coming out from the bottle. This is because the air pressure pushes the water. In this experiment, we will learn to create a rainbow effect with water. Let's do an amazing experiment. Take four glasses of clear water. Add one spoon sugar in first glass. Add two spoons sugar in second glass. Add 3 spoons sugar in 3rd glass. Add 4 spoons sugar in 4th glass. Add different food colors to 4 glasses. Stir 
them well. Follow it with the third glass and the fourth glass. Take an empty glass. Take an injection. With the help of the injection, pour the colored water in the empty glass. You can see the water stacking one by one. This is because of the different density of the sugar. In this experiment, we are going to learn how the flower takes up different colors. This is because the stem of the flower drinks up the water and provides it to the leaves and flowers. In this experiment, we are going to learn how the water from the plate goes in the glass. This is because gases exert pressure from an area of high pressure to an area of low pressure.